hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel firstly i want to say thanks for the positive comments in regards to the last tutorial i did how to make ama piano bass sound on logic in this tutorial i'm going to be showing you how to use the pitch correction plugin on logic pro x which many people don't know that it works perfectly and also i'll make a comparison between wavestone and logic pro x pitch correction plugins before we get started please click the subscribe and the notification button for you to see more of my future posts let's get started firstly we're going to create two audio tracks All right, uh, I'm just going to be dragging an audio file on Logic Library just to make this easy and simple. So let's go to Instrument Vocals. Let's see what we've got here. I think I'm going to go with this vocal, so we're going to drag this into our audio track. Firstly, I'm going to be using the wave tune, so let's go to my wave tunes. Uh, where is it? Wave tune. After launching the wave tune plugin. The second thing we need to do is to get the key where the song is or where the vocal is. So if you already have your vocal recorded in, on an instrumental, so I am, I'm sure you know the key where your instrumental is already. So uh, here, I, because I didn't record this vocal, I just took one of the vocals from the uh, Logic Pro sound library. So what we're going to be doing now is uh, try to get the key of, of this vocal. So let me launch the keyboard here. Yeah, let me try. Alright, the vocal key is on F. We just highlight this and and we go to the key section, we put in F and we make it a major scale. The speed is gonna set to zero, no transition zero. So let's listen to how it sounds with the vocal tune. Again. All right, now let's go to the pitch correction plugin on Logic. So let's make a, a comparison of how it sounds with the one on logic audio plugin it's pitch then pitch correction we're just going to use the same vocal we drag it down to audio 2 where the logic pro x pitch correction 2 is so we already know the key so here we change it to major scale then it brings out the keys we already know the key of this vocal which is F then you can set the response parameter so let's just put it on zero let's listen so So let's make the comparison.
let's listen to the one for In my own opinion, I would prefer the pitch correction plugin on Logic Pro to any other plugin because firstly, I don't need to buy an extra plugin for auto-tune for pitch correction because I can achieve the same results that we get on auto-tune, on wave-tune, here on pitch correction plugin in Logic Pro X. Let me just leave this one more time for us to listen to the difference. <laughs> Let's check the wave tone out. Then both together. Alright. This is going to be the end of the tutorial. If you find this tutorial useful, please like, subscribe to my YouTube channel and leave a positive comment below. Thank you very much.